Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Satisfactory. Today we are going to unlock Caterium technology. I have made everything ready. We just need to stick the last 500 uh, wires in here and do the unlock. So we're going to do that. Caterium acquisition unlocked. Additional to new Push. equipment, building and parts utilizing basic Caterium properties. R&D insisted on inflating your pocket dimension. So we get another five inventory slots. We get Caterium ingots, we get Require, we get Power Pulse Mark 2, we get Blade Runners, and we get Scanner Update for Caterium. So that is going to be our objective for today. That is going to be to go and find some Caterium uh, so that we can make some Blade Runners for ourselves. Because... Basically, I'm sick of running very, very slow. And so, this uh, should be what we need. But we also have the MAM here, where in the last episode we... Ex what was it? Raw Quartz? So, Raw Quartz is completed. Very nice. This type of quartz possesses optimal piezoelectric properties and can be utilized to create oscillators and silicon, which are used in a variety of appliances. A new milestone has been added to tier 4. Additional research required. Okay, we're going to go check that out. But first I think I want to stick... I think we have 10 alien carapaces, so let's just stick them in there. Yes, we do. And let's get those researched. And there we go. Alright, so let's take a look at uh, what this stuff is. Explorer, very nice. The map, looking forward to that. Quartz crystal, crystal oscillator, the explorer, really looking forward to that. And scanner update for raw quartz. Wow, that's pretty expensive to research. Uh, so we're probably going to do that a little bit later. Uh, I do want to get Logistics Mark 3 very soon, so that will probably be the next thing that we research, if not improved combat, because the Sino Basher would be really nice as well. But to begin with, five extra inventory slots, slots not bad. Uh, before we go exploring, uh, I basically have everything on us that we need. I just want to show you what I have done in between episodes. So, I have built a bridge over here, uh, because we have trucks going both directions here and coming into that truck station. So I didn't want those guys to run into each other all the time. And, uh, so, that has been set up. And also, I have set up... And I hope this is working. Oh, here it comes, actually. I can just see him there. We are unloading iron plates. And sending them into our factory. So that's pretty cool. And if we go up top, I have set up a... Oh, can't I get in this way? No. I need to... Turn that around or something. I can't get in this way. So here. And I have set up that our coal is... Uh, it's coming up here, right? Going into this container. We're coming out, being split here. Running all the way over there. The other way is coming this way and being split into there. Then we will have it running over here into this container, uh, feeding uh, this thing and splitting again and feeding this thing over here on the other side and so on and so forth. And the same with the other side. So we will have, uh, what is it? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, ten containers of coal to 
fill up our trucks once they get filled up, of course. And here we have the iron plate production coming in. And they are coming in uh, from down here, of course. Right there. And we will have containers going all the way down here and around and back. And probably around and back and around and back. And then we will have iron pickup, I think, uh, probably here and maybe over here as well. We'll probably at least need at least two iron pickups, iron plate pickups, uh, maybe three. I'm not sure yet. We'll figure it out. So this uh, tractor that is feeding the iron plates in here is coming. It's coming up over there onto the iron plate uh, production line picking it up coming down here coming up and going on this bridge and going down and unloading going over the bridge down there at the end that i just showed you and going back up and picking up again oh so yeah it, uh, it took a while to set up but uh, it works so that's pretty cool. And I've actually been thinking because we will have a lot of products here, right? So we will probably, above this level of storage, we'll probably need to have another level of trucks and then another level of storage upstairs uh, again. So yeah, it's going to be a big building. All right, so let's uh, do this. Let's scan for uh, Caterium and see where it is. Oh. Where is it? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. 380 meters. That's not too bad. Where's the other one? 600, 1700. Okay, let's go to the one right over here. Nice and close. Again. Hundred and eighty meters. I wonder if we need to go above or below. I guess we'll find out. Here it comes, it looks like it's below. There it is. Crap. We need a uh, explosive to get the, get to that. So, when there's poison down there, and nasty place, nasty place. But we can see the Conterium all right there. But since there are rocks on top and we don't have explosives left yet, yet let's uh, go and take a look at the other one. Maybe there's no explo no uh, rocks on that. What do we have here? We have impure iron ore. Too bad that there are so many impure everywhere in this area. Okay, let's go over here and see if this one is clear of rocks. And let's just scan again. Up here, limestone, that impure. Okay, let's see. There's a power slug. Any defenders around? I don't see any. So we're gonna grab that. Let's see, it's over this way. I guess on the other side of the waterfall over there. So let's see if we can get up and find that. Ooh, nuts. Ooh, and berries. There. Like nuts and berries. Oh, bacon. Like 
that too. There's some uh, quartz. Let's uh, grab that one. Go. Nuts. What are all these plants, leaves, and stuff doing in the air? I guess they're uh, blowing in the wind without blowing so much. And what is that? Huh. Okay. Weird. This looks really weird. Alright, I, I need to take a screenshot of this. What the hell is going on? Let's just uh, get this out of our hand. That looks so strange. I am guessing uh, there's some unfinished business here for the developers. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's put that back in our hand so we can defend ourselves. And scan for the tear more again. 98 meters, it's over there. Uh, let's jump down here, down here, and build a bridge. I think we'll use these foundations for it. And keep going. We're gonna have to defend ourselves once we get over there, I can see. Um flying little weasels. Get back up. Hi. I think there's one left. I guess we need to do a platform here to jump on. But we can't even get up on that. And over here. Go. Here you little shit. There. Dead. And the carapace is there, and there is the caterium. Pure caterium. Fantastic. Now I am just going to uh, mine some of this uh, caterium. Let's see how much space do we have. Some. And uh, then I'll run back to base, and I will see you when I get there. We'll see you in a second, guys. Okay, so we are back, and uh, we are not back at the base, because I accidentally took a little detour and found a wreck. I have also found a... Uh, what's it called? Yellow power slug and the Mercer Sphere on the way. And so, yeah. Uh, at this crash site there were some, some uh, frames, some uh, reinforced iron plate, and some wire, uh, and some cable as well. And if we look out here in the water, that is where the, um, the pod is, and it needs 20 megawatts and 4 steel beams. We don't have steel beams right now, so unfortunately we won't be able to open that at this time but there is a power slug over here there are also two thingies guarding it but uh, let's go get it 
Might as well, right? One down. One charge. Charge. Not too early there. And there's the power slug, so let's grab that. And there are some nuts over here. What's this? Copper or don't care. This is a pretty interesting area. I think we're entering the, the jungle, lush jungle thing biome this way. Uh, and we're not actually supposed to be going exploring. Whoa, that's dangerous down there. I'm not going that way right now. Okay. Let's go back. Uh, what's up here this way? Hmm. Just have a quick peek before we go home. Nothing particularly interesting right now. I don't see anything worth mentioning. Whoa, flag. What, what is going on? Whoa, what a huge flag spike. Okay. Nothing particularly interesting here. Though the area looks very interesting. I haven't been here before, I think. Okay. So let's go back. Ooh, that's a little bit interesting. And what's up this way? We go this way and look already. There's a bird. Uh, or ooh, the power slug. Oh, and a big guy. Those things were. I'm going to need to get some nuts and get the hell out of here. I got some more nuts, didn't I? Let's, let's just eat those. And try and uh, take that thing out. Get the power slug. Where'd it go? There it is. Hopefully it's a little bit hurt. Oh! Stop that. Meaning. Good. More down there. So let's just pick this up and go home. This area seems a little bit too dangerous without our uh, Sino Basher. So very interesting. Okay. Let's go home. Um, let's uh, see if we find something on the way. I'll uh, start running home, and uh, if we don't find anything interesting on the way, I will be back when we're back at the base, else I will be back when we find something interesting. Okay, so we are back here at the base, and I have unlocked the uh, improved melee combat. I have crafted up all of the quick wire. And all we need to do now is craft some Blade Runners. Let's do that. Done. And craft a Sino Basher. Done. Let's just make a few beacons. Let's get to 20 beacons. Oh, and drop off the uh, bacon here. Because we're not going to be using the bacon or the uh, the berries. We'll only use. Whoops, sorry about that. We'll only use the um, the nuts so far. I also crafted a uh, object scanner, so we can scan for stuff if we need to. But let's uh, get out of here. 
And where are our... There's our Blade Runners, very nice. And there's our Xeno Basher, fantastic. And we actually have an extra slot for hands now, which is really nice. So let's, let's do the scanner for that, for now. Because I think we are going to go exploring. Do some rods for that. And I want to go back where those minis were and and get that uh, that wreck because we want the the recipes. I unfortunately forgot to put down a beacon over there, but uh, hopefully we can find it again. Ah, oh, look at that! Look how fast we're running! It's fantastic! So much faster! Oh, I love it! Oh, I love it! We'll be back there in no time. But I will uh, just do a quick cut here and actually craft up some uh, some steel beams so that we have what it takes to uh, to, to open that uh, pod. And uh, then I will see you when we get over there. So see you in a second, guys. Okay, so we're back and we are at another wreck, uh, which I found on the way. So let's see if we can open that. Oh man, I love these Blade Runners, it's fantastic. Anything else? Uh, no, doesn't look like it. What did we get? We got some encased industrial beams, which is really nice. And some circuits. Not bad. Let's uh, check out the pod. It's operational. Excellent. It just needs a quick wire. Hey, fantastic. Nice that we got that done. There we go. Hard drive. And let's keep going. I thought I saw a power slug up here as well. Oh, there are some more circuit boards. There's a power slug over there. Man, I'm stuck. No! Crap! I hate when I get stuck. Man! Okay, I am going to uh, respawn and run back here, and then I'll see you in a second. Okay, so I am back again. I have picked up our stuff, and I have picked up the power slug that was over here. And down there is some nuts, which we would like. Um, let's see. I realized after I had just, just seconds after I had clicked respawn, I realized that I could have probably just gotten out my uh, my chainsaw and chop down the tree and be free, but oh well, you live and you learn. Okay, so let's go exploring. Uh, let's see more flying stuff there. I really want to find some... Um, what's down here? Well, that's the beach, right? Yeah. I really, really want to find some uh, some wrecks to get those alternate uh, recipes. Because they are... S some of them are extremely useful. Extremely useful. There's a big baddie there. We're almost dead, so let's just eat some barrel nuts before we start taking him on. But we will take him on. Summer Sloop. Not that they're that interesting yet, because they're still a work in progress, but 
Then we'll have them for when there are no more work in progress. All right, so let's see, where is that wreck? Is it down here? No, I don't think so. Nope. Oh, there's another big blue. Jesus. A lot of big loonies in this area. Oh, we're almost dead. Run away, run away. Hide, eat. Got him. Uh, so what's here since he was guarding this area? Doesn't seem like there's anything here. Does it? I don't see anything. Uh, let's try and jump up here if we can. Come on, jump, jump. Jump. And jump. Wow, dang it. Okay, never mind. Oh, there's a power slug up there. Okay. Um, guess we can get that later. Let's go around. Uh, we'll just go around. What's that? Limestone. Don't care. Guess we can get it from up here. If we can get up here. Uh, can we get up there somehow? Without having to build our way up there. That would be nice. Doesn't look like it. Nah. Right, we'll leave that power slug for now. Not power slugs that we're hunting right now, it's wrecks. We have a ton of power slugs at home. Oh. Mm. That mean. Okay, so let's see. We have here, here's an ore patch of some kind. Pure iron ore. Not bad. Here we get down to another beach. Just go have a look. Nuts. And some minis. And nothing else it seems. There's a power slug over there, but I live without that right now. I just want Rex. So let's run back. As I think, oh, more nuts. This should, and more nuts. Put all our nuts in the hand. I have an idea that that crash site is up this way somewhere. Probably, yeah, uh, see, we've already picked that. Oh, it's down here. It is down here somewhere. Yes, there, over there. Great. Let's go get the crash site and do some more exploring. So we need to build a generator, a biomass burner. Do you have any biomass to burn? Nope. And grab some leaves. There we go. And stick those in there. And build a power pole. That's too steep. Okay, build the power pole. There, there, and there. And operational because I already made the steel beams. Very good. That's two hard drives. Let's pick this stuff up again. And keep exploring. Uh, so there were some nuts over here, I noticed. There they are. And let's go this way. Oh, I think in this cave I found 
Immersive Sphere and uh, uh, a Power Slug earlier. Let's come back this way. I think it was up this way. But there was something, some area that looked pretty interesting. We could go up here. And... Yeah, I think we're, this lag is because we're changing biomes, I think. Here. Another the beach, is that the beach we just saw? Yeah, it is. Okay. Let's go back. And go this way. Take a look-see. Okay, what we have... We have some limestone, very un interesting. And... There's some minis there, let's kill them. I guess we'll take that. And what do we have here? Nuts. It's a power slug up there. Oh, more minis. Let's just kill him. islands out there that look interesting. Ooh, there's a wreck. And a mini. Let's heal up. There we go. And go take care of this mini. Is that one of the big ones? Yes, it is. Oh, Jesus, that hurt. Run. Eat. Weapon. Standing, there's its organs there, and there are some nuts over there. We'll grab them immediately. Oh, and there's some nuts up there. Grab those as well, and stick them in our hand. Going through nuts quite fast, it feels like. But oh, there are more minis there. I didn't notice you there, guys. Here one. There. Come here. Where is it? There. Bye. Alright. Right. So what do we have here? We have circuit boards, heavy modular frames, not bad. Uh, some screws, a lot of screws, some reinforced iron plates, some wire. Anything else? Doesn't look like it. No. Uh, okay. Yeah, there's some reinforced time plate. So let's open the drop pod. It's operational. Fantastic. And that's three hard drives we have now. Um, let's see. Do we see any other wrecks or anything? And there's some minis and a... Power slug over there. Hmm. You wanna go get that power slug? These guys are protecting something. Uh, that. 
Is there a cave in there or something? Just a path. Okay. Can we get up to that power slug without having to build? We have to build, I'm not going up there. Not right now. I don't think I think we have to build. So let's not go up there right now. More nuts, more better. There is a power slug up there, which would be nice to get, but we we uh, have enough power slugs for now. We can always go get some more. Let's go over to the islands have a look, and have a look. And do, do we swim faster with the uh, with the blade runners as well? I have no idea. Okay, there's a mini running around over there on that island. See. Swim, swim. It's so good that there are no minis in the water because we have absolutely no way to defend ourselves while we're swimming. Oh, there's poison over there as well. Don't like that. Don't like poison. We steer clear of it, or should we go get that power slug now that we're here? Maybe we should steer clear of it. Nuts. Nuts. That limestone. More nuts. Run up here and have a look. Looks like there's something under there that we can blow up and get. Oh. Don't like you. More. I think. What do we have here? Oh, there's an oil patch there. Okay. Limestone. Okay. We're not gonna go over and kill those things right now. We uh, we don't need oil at this time. Let's go this way. Oh, nuts. Something. And oil. Ah, okay, I know where we are now. Which means that there's more more oil over there. I thought there was a crash site somewhere as well, maybe. Not entirely sure. A big mini. There's a lot of small minis. Some box art looks like. Yeah. Hmm. Um, thought there was another crash site around here. I'm not actually sure now. But I know where we are, so that's a good thing. That looks interesting. Over there. I don't think I've, I've been over there before. Well, yeah. okay. There's a crash site. Or maybe I have. There's a thing, a big thing, and a small thing. The big things. Uh... Oh, there's more. Shit. 
Uh, eat, eat. Ah, this is a dangerous area. Where's the shooting thing there? They fixed it so you don't can't run into them and hide inside them. That's a bit annoying. But fair enough, I guess. Come on, die. Thank you. Alright, let's have a look at this wreck. Uh, reinforced iron play, table, ooh, computer. Oh, there's one more. Cable, computers. Ooh, heavy modular frames and more heavy modular frames. Nice. This will help us along quite a bit, actually. Anything else? Doesn't look like it. Nope, but there is a pod. And it's operational. Great. Okay, so that's four. Um, hard drives we have now. So I think we will call that good for this episode. So I'll just go grab these nuts. Come on, swim, swim. All right, so uh, yeah, and that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and maybe subscribe, and I will see you next time.